where Kusick wants to be in this situation with only 30 seconds left to go. Nat tries to take him down right on the edge. 22 seconds. Reed trying to go for the takedown on the win, and he does get two points there with 20 seconds left. Camp, business administration major here at Kutztown, a finance focus. Here at 157, these two are ready to roll. Yeah, the points are fine so far at 157. Dugan seems to be in a little bit of control with another takedown there, making the score 8-3. That's an important like, this, talent to have. Those are good skills to know, absolutely. Babcock really looking to turn Emig here on top, and he hasn't had any success so far turning for the back points, but it looks like he's in a position here where he may be able to get. He's trying to flip him around. Now he's trying to earn back points, maybe go for the win by fall is Babcock. Real close there. He's going to have at least four back points, our officials showing. 30 seconds to go in the period, so he does have some time to flip him around if he can hold him here and win by fall. Babcock trying to really tighten this match up here at 174 pounds. If he can get that last positioning, he's almost got the Golden Bear around, and he does. Babcock wins by fall with just 17 seconds to go here in the second period, and that's a big six points for Shippensburg. He found himself several times near the edge of the mat where both wrestlers almost agreed to bring things back to the middle. You see Emig there being hit with a second stall warning, and unfortunately he was put in a position where he almost just had to turn his back and give up the takedown there. So he gives up the takedown and the, the stall, stall warning point, so a three-point swing right there. And now it's...